Hey buddy, hey buddy. <laughs> <laughs> a little chilly morning I've been uh, trying to figure something out this couple of days down here at Shanto Canyon leaves are starting to turn pretty cool this little guy can't leave me alone but yeah I've been trying to figure out how or what am I gonna do with the Nav Na Native American Heritage Month is uh, November and I've been planning on hopefully to make a video I'm a little distracted by the dog but yeah I wanted to make a video for that and I kind of started this morning with uh, you know Stanley loading up the truck and then Howard water truck but the uh, breaker's not on because when it gets cold they have to shut the breaker off and then they turn it back on but I gotta head back up to the yard and then I'll be back down but I hope it's gonna go okay I have like a general idea of how I'm gonna make that video but not 100% on what it's gonna look like Very, very cool being here, especially with the uh, leaves really changing, starting to change. It's a little green. They do uh, things called Rock the Canyon down here. The Chanteau Canyon. There's a stage down here as well. I showed uh, Rob this one time when he started with us and he didn't know about that. The stage down here. You can kind of see it. I don't have the uh, the lens for it. You can make it out right there. Chapter house over there. It's cool to come down here. <laughs> uh oh, he sees me. He's like, my buddy, my buddy's back. Nope, he's gonna stay on that side. <laughs> Arvin was laughing because he got a little rough with him, playing around with his legs. Whew, just stopped here. You can kind of see my phone. Waiting for a meeting to start. Have service here. I can't drive any more further down. Goes into like a uh, wash canyon, then I lose service. But, out in the wild. <laughs> Answer a question right now. I only went for the kids day the Thursday I didn't do this the Friday or the Saturday or the Sunday some of you have asked me a question if I was gonna be there the next day or the parade 
No. As you guys know. You saw the Dig Deep tent. He probably said highs. Saw Amy. Maybe saw Cruz out there. But I was kind of busy. And I was riding around trying to uh, get the feel for my ankles. And, you know, just riding around. Went down the flag. Got stuck in the rain. <laughs> Not... Not my uh, my proudest moment, but yeah, I got stuck in the rain, got rained on, got cold, got stuck in traffic. All in all, fun days. <laughs> but yeah, thanks for everybody that stopped by, that said hi to Amy, to tell, that told Amy to tell me they said hi. Gordon, I tried to tell Amy to give you an autograph on your forehead. <laughs> but yeah, it was fun. I really enjoyed it. I wish I would have uh, just went back for another day and did more interactions and a little more filming or just me holding the camera in front of everybody and kind of like flipping it like this and talking to the camera and just getting more people around. But hopefully one of these days I can get you guys on there. The meeting has probably started right now. Mike, can you hear me? No, he cannot hear me. Mike. Is anybody on the call that can hear me? I don't think anybody can hear me. Maybe not. I don't know. But if they can hear me, they can hear me talking to myself all alone like a lonely loner. The lonely loner that I am. But, yeah, I'm going to get on this thing. What we all need to be doing. It's, a, it's always, like, hard on a Monday morning. Oh. <laughs> Are you recording us, Donovan? Yeah. <laughs> hey, Crystal. Oh, you're on mute. <laughs> no caller. Donovan, that looks scary. Like, I feel like I'm being... <laughs> Watched through a wave, lens. Cindy. Getting ready to, to head out, but apparently they could hear me. <laughs> They're laughing about me talking to myself, singing to myself, saying I'm all alone. But I'm gonna head out right now. Whew. It's a fun day. Got some tanks prepped. You can kind of see it behind me. One is on a trailer. And then... That water truck is all dirty. Got hit with a bunch of mud. <laughs> so, I was hoping to do it today. If you've seen some of my Instagram photos or more... Uh, posts not post posts but when you stories I put some like astro photography some little time lapse seeing the Milky Way the uh, what do you call that thing the Aurora last night I got a sweet picture of the Milky Way with right around here the comet and before that I tried it on my on the GoPro I tried to record it one time and it was when the comet was at its brightest on the 16th something like that it was on Sunday and it was too quick. It was too low to the ground. I got a glimpse of it and then it went away like seconds because it was a time lapse. So I just took pictures and all that. And last night I tried to take another, ever since then it's been cloudy every night. And then last night I took a time lapse again. You can kind of see it. It's like pretty far up here because the, 
<laughs> yeah, getting all cross-eyed right here. <laughs> the, uh, the, the Milky Way is like coming from here. It goes like this a little bit. Like that, right there. It comes around that area. A little canted like this. And then the comet's around here. I got a glimpse of it. You can barely see it, but when you take your phone out and then you boost up the exposure, you can get a glimpse of it and then you take a picture, still a photo, you can see it. Just like that, you can see a, a, a comet going on. So I tried recording it, taking a time lapse. I got it pretty good. All the clouds came in. <laughs> Didn't get to see it go past the horizon when you see like another like split shot of it. There's some clouds up there. I'm hoping it goes away so I can try again a little more, one more attempt, probably two more attempts. But I'm either going to record it as a cell phone view. So when you have it on your phone, you get the full uh, photo of it. Or I might record it for YouTube, so I'm trying to think about that. So I can post it on here instead of on Instagram. So I, I may record it this way, wide, wide screen, <laughs> or uh, the land, the landscape, or uh, portrait style. So I'm still trying to guess, figure out on that if I'm going to do it that way or not. I like por portrait style because you can see all the stars and everything going by and looks looks pretty nice when you see it on your phone. Unless you go on YouTube, it's all uh, landscape style, so if you turn your phone sideways, you can see a lot more of it. But we'll see. Uh, rambling on, getting a little sidetracked. So yeah, that's what I was trying to do last night, but it just didn't work out. But, yeah, I'm going to head on home. Everybody's gone. It's just me here. Finished my email. Should be leaving pretty soon. There's some dogs running around. Um, but, yeah, thanks for watching. See you guys in the next one. And, yeah, I'll catch you guys later.